Okay, so basically this video is to explain or show how I made my profile picture. Also, don't mind my crusty, musty, dusty voice. Anyway, so basically what you want to do is you want to go to catalog avatar creator. You want to join in. And first thing, the heck happened to my avatar? Okay, first thing you want to do is you want to hit the little stars and you want to go to pose editor. And what you do is you can select any part of the body and you can make it, or you can change the shape of it to be whatever pose you want it to be. So for me, I'm just going to do a simple wave. I'm going to turn my head a little bit. If you want to do the exact same pose, that's completely fine. So you can apply that pose and you want to hit the camera icon and you can turn it to be her face whatever way you want. And you want to hit the image looking icon and you, go, you can change the colour to whatever colour, usually a colour that suits your avatar, like for me. Um, actually, it, I don't think it matters too much, so usually just make it white. And you can change the colour of the spotlight, usually I just do white. Change the spotlight angle to make it brighter or darker, just whatever looks good to you. And then you can adjust the camera to whatever position you want. Like that's perfect for me. So I'm going to screenshot this. And now you can... And what you can do is you go to uh, a drawing app. I use Ibis Paint. Which is free to download. Um, and you can import your picture. So what you want to do, you can go to Pinterest, because I don't have the app, so I just search it up. And you can search up whatever background you like. So for me, I'm going to go grey GFX background. And I'm just going to see whichever one I like. I'm just going to pick this one. And you can screenshot that and if you can't save it, which I can't, so I just screenshot it. Save the photos. And you can go back to your app. And for me, because I can't get rid of the background, I just spend not too long, but a little bit, just erasing the whole background. So I'll speed this up so it doesn't take forever, but... Basically, just want to raise the whole background. Okay, so now I haven't completely erased the background, but considering I'm doing a white one, it should be fine. So I'm just going to import the picture. And I can make it, or you can make it whatever size you like. Usually, you just fit the frame. Mm -hmm. and then you can add your image on top and as you can see now you can actually really see where um, I did not fully outline it or get re-raised the background but what I like to do next is I like to go to brush and I change the brush to white and go 100% opacity and what you want to do is you want to add a layer and so it's not on the background and it's not on your avatar and you can put up the size however you like but you just go around the edge of your avatar and so I like this I think this looks good so what I'm gonna do now is and I'm gonna go back to and I'm gonna go lightning transparent background So you go images, yep. 
so what you want to do is you want to look on here you can you can search up whatever you like but you have to go on here and look for uh, a transparent background so you can add it okay here we go we found one that works and so I'm gonna put this underneath my avatar and so now we've got one that I can put over the top now you could just do that or that and if you don't love it you can always change the opacity so this I think 25% looks good there we go we found another one that works that's always good do this again change the opacity and if you don't like it if it's on your face of course you can just erase that like I like it on my arms and stuff but I don't really like it on my face so I'm just gonna erase that off my face and there we go I think that looks pretty good also, another thing you can do is if you want to add the glossy effect, make sure to add another layer and you can go up here, you can make it thicker and then make this side thin, you can just do that and let's say I want some here and potentially here potentially here and here and then now you can just blur it blur it and blur it this is exactly here and now looking at it it looks a bit more glossy and you can add it and make it as thick as you like wherever you want to like there I might want it there A bit more glossy and now you can add this is what I like to add I like to add clouds so I go gray transparent background and then um, gray cloud transparent background there we go and now I can grab one of these okay hopefully we've got a good one now this one work no does this one work yes there we go so for this I need to make it a bit bigger and I just add it right to the bottom you can smudge it which is always good smudging it makes it whatever size you want it to be so let's just say I want it like that. I think that looks great. So now, this is optional, but I prefer it. So I go cap cut, or logo transparent background. Because I use cap cut, so if you use After Effects or something like that, you can always do that. So that's a white background. Does this one work? This does this look good? Looks pretty good to me. Is it transparent though? Yes, it is. Okay, here I move this and I can rotate it to whatever I want it to be. And of course, I'm going to add that above there. Okay. I'm going to add mine right there or if you want particularly for mine oopsie it's not wanting to there we go doesn't really fit on this side I could put it here doesn't look too great though so here looks like it it's better fit there I'm going to put mine right there and so now you can save it and if you if you do want 
you can put the title of your um, username but I don't usually put mine because I'm not very good at text so I'm just going to leave it as that so I have to go to YouTube Studio and here I have to click on my profile picture in the corner and then here that's when I can choose from my photos which I've got this which I like I like this and I can just leave it as this pretty much and I just save this so now go okay, and now it's like that and this is how to change your profile picture on mobile have a great day